That was quick. What's going on, everybody? It's Monkey Farm. We're back with some more modded Ark Survival Evolved here on the Pooping Evolved modded server. Uh, thank you for joining me. If you are new here, make sure you hit that subscribe button and thumb it up if you enjoy yourself. And uh, leave a comment below. Say hi. Um, so you might notice that things look a little empty around here. We've got some news for you. <laughs> As expected, um, we finally ran into some mod problems. And uh, it seems like it was the Star Wars mod or the Stark Wars mod, whatever they call it. Um, so we've temporarily removed that. Hopefully it's temporary. Who knows if we'll, uh, we'll have it back. And you're not going to believe, I I had almost gathered everything I needed for that Sith, uh, the Ascendant Sith Lord lightsaber thing. Look at all this cementing paste, all these pearls, all this metal, the obsidian, everything. You're not going to believe it. But um, we also uh, had removed a color, I think it was a colored dinos mod or something like that. And um, all the dinos disappeared. So people are out taming new dinos all from scratch so luckily i didn't have anything so it's awesome for me <laughs> actually um yeah i was uh i wanted to go out and get a rex today um but we're gonna go get a pteranodon real quick and then we're gonna go get a rex i did see a level 700 right across the river there um i know there's a lot of bugs over there though and i have nothing i really have nothing to kill it with or to kill bugs with um i have borrowed a uh i think this one i think this pteranodon um it's it's just a uh, community one that somebody has tamed already um so i'm gonna come over here see if i can find that level 700 it's really dark so i can't really see anything um, but, uh, I have my special guns with me. I've got the dream machine with 32 bullets and I also have the Dan inject rifle. I'm going to use the Dan inject rifle on the Pteranodon because, uh, that should make it, uh, that one should be really easy to knock out. And of course it's not going to attack me. So I don't really have to worry about speed. And since these bullets are so expensive, um, I want to save, there it is. I want to save the, uh, the dream machine bullets. Let me see if I can gamma up a bit so we can see something. I want to see if the dream machine bullets uh, save those for a bad T-Rex. You know, an overpowered, crazy T-Rex. Because uh, we're gonna <laughs> we're gonna have to uh, make sure we knock it out quick. You know what I mean? All right. Do you hear any bugs? I don't hear any bugs yet, so that's pretty good. Um, let's let's see if we can. Okay, there's one. Get out of my way! Ah. Oh. All right. Hopefully this is the same one. Hopefully we didn't lose it. Yep. All right. So we're just gonna wait till he lands. I'm sure his torpor will uh, wear off slowly or whatever. But uh, that's how we're gonna do it. <laughs> Come here, little Tyrannodon. You know you wanna be my friend. Are you landing? I think you're landing. What do you say you land right there? There he goes. That was quick. All right, so hopefully hopefully we don't get bugs or any bad animals jumping off the cliff trying to kill us. Um, I have already prepared. I've already prepared everything. I've got the kibble on me. There's dodo kibble right there. So this should be really quick. Um, so that was cool. Two hits for a, for a level 700. So that's pretty cool. Um, yeah, from what I hear, uh, the Dream Machine is way, 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 way more powerful. It's like 6,000 Torpor or something. Uh, so that's pretty sweet. Has this guy eaten yet? Nope. Um, oh, you know what? I should uh, I should keep some of this in case something happens. I'll just put two in at a time. In case something weird happens, because I don't really have anything to fight off bugs or other animals that come at us, so I'm just going to have to run. And if they eat the pteranodon, they're gonna, he's going to eat all my kibble. Uh, so I guess we'll be okay. Ooh, 
did I hear? I hear little bug footsteps. It's probably just my footsteps. All right, so we're gonna watch this guy. What level is this thing? 681? So nice. Um, I can't wait to see what level this guy is gonna level up to once he eats. Let's give him another one just because I'll probably forget that I have to keep adding more. Um, let's see, 30, 80. So he, he's got a little bit more hunger to go before he's gonna eat. All right, everyone, we're back. I think we have one more bite of kibble left. And um, we are going to get, we should get uh, 349 extra levels. So he's going to be uh, 1049. Pretty sweet. Um, so our starting base stats are 4600, 3000 stamina, uh, melee is 515, weight's 486. So with the boost, uh, the extra levels, um, it should be even better than that. Um, let's call this guy round two. Um, let's see, uh, let's see, this guy, yeah, the passive, let's see, and we're gonna have you follow us, so what are your stats now? Ooh, 1189 melee already, 7200 health, this guy's a monster, 136, uh, speed, I think that's what all of them come out at, um, cool, and weight's 576, this guy's pretty awesome, actually, um, let's compare him to 681, this guy, uh, oh, this guy's been pumped up quite a bit level, so uh, I don't know what his base stats were. Um, so let's get back to the base. I need to make a saddle for it, and we'll go uh, We'll go search for a Rex. What's up, people? We're back. We are on the southeast island. This is actually uh, on the other side of this island is where uh, zuljin has got his base. Uh, but I came over here to see if I could find a good Rex, and um, this guy knocked off the side here. I, uh, I was flying around to kill everything in the area. There's a Giga somewhere around here. I need to make sure I stay away from him. I think I think he's this direction. Yep, there he is. Stay away. Um, so that should be far enough away where um, stuff won't come into the area too much at least. So let me show you the stats of the Tranodon here real quick. It's like this guy's just waiting for us or something. Hey, buddy. Hey, buddy. Hey, buddy. Uh, we have like 3,000 melee. Just making sure he can't get up here. Um, we have 3,000 melee, 300 movement speed, 13,000 health, 4,900 stam. Um... Weight I pumped a little bit too. So I guess this is it. I think we're ready. I mean, how much how much nicer could this situation be? The guy can't get up or can he? Oh, by the way, he's uh, level 504. I've been looking for quite a while and this is the highest level I've seen. I haven't seen really anything of high level. There's like a three or 400 down further down the island over there. Um, let's see. We need to do the number three here. Are you on passive? Yes. All right. All right. He's kind of glowing green. I don't really know if I have to wait. Come back here. Uh, I think, I think all the torpor happens, like, immediately, so. I need to make sure I hit this guy. <laughs> Uh-oh. Hey, dude. I have no idea how many bullets this is gonna take. Oh, there he goes. All right. Whoops, put that away. Let's um, let's hop on our little buddy here. Um, I hope I can land here. Um, am I gonna slide down the hill? I just might. I've got the kibble on me. 
Oh, oh, whew. okay. Thought we were gonna slide down the hill for a sec. All right, so we've got some uh, some scorpion kibble on there. I'm gonna put, let's see, I'll put like 13 on it. I'll keep some backup just in case something weird happens. Um, I've got some narcotics here. I shouldn't need a whole lot. All right, we're back and we've got one bite left. We're gonna get uh, 251 extra levels. There he goes. Nice. What's up, buddy? What's up, Rexy Poo? Rexy Poo? Is that how you spell that? I don't know. Um, let's put him on passive. And now we'll put him on neutral and we'll have him follow us. Can we get him up the hill? Yes, that's nice. All right, I'm gonna have him unfollow us. I need to go find out. I forget where the Giga is. There's there's a Giga either on this level or right up here on this level. And I need to make sure, uh-oh. Need to make sure we don't encounter him where, there he is. <laughs> all right. Um, all right, so I guess what we'll do is we'll have him follow us up here to this level Rexy Poo where are you there you are oh is that another Giga no that's another Rex Let's see what we got here uh, 448 so that's lower than us um, and we've got 728 shouldn't be that big a deal um, I think Rexy Poo should be able to make it up this hill, no problemo. I should just barrel roll these guys. Eat him, Rexy Poo. Eat him, Rexy Poo. Get him, Rexy Poo. There we go. Nice. All right. Um, so there's a Stargate that Zul'jin has over at his base. That was quick. Um, and we should be able, whoops, we should be able to get uh, Rexy Poo to go through the portal. And then, uh, and then we'll get him back home really quickly so he won't have to like follow us or anything. <laughs> it's my little puppy dog. All right. There we go. Let's see. There he goes. Um, so what I'm going to have to do. Oh, crud. Hmm. I need to figure out, he needs to walk through the portal somehow uh, while it's on. All right, we're back. Uh, I decided to make a, uh, a saddle for this guy, so I'll just ride him through uh, rather than uh, try to get him to follow me because there's really not, uh, there's not a whole lot of space over here, so he probably wouldn't follow uh, go through the uh, the portal. So what we're gonna do? We are going to dial up Spawn Town. All right, we gotta wait, wait until this thing fires up, and there it is. And let's see if Rexy Poo can get through there. Oh, there we are. We're home. All right, and let's run through real quick before it closes and go get, uh-oh, uh-oh. Can we only go through once? I guess we gotta set it off again. All right, there we go. All right, let's see if I have to reload this thing again or if we can fly. Yep, we gotta reload it again. All right, so we'll see you back at, at hometown. All right, we are back home. Let's take him out 
Let's take Rexy Poo out to chomp some faces. Got to level him up. Get his melee up. He's got pretty low melee, it looks like. His health is... Uh, let's Actually, let's check out his stats. I already... I boosted uh, the melee and speed a little bit when I got back. I forgot to, uh, to, for, to show you guys the stats first. Um, but he's got 1,700 melee um, up to 142 speed. I think that was at 100 when he tamed out. I don't, I don't remember. Um, he's got 22,000 health. Um, we'll probably pump that up as well. Um, yeah. So let's go see if we can find anything that will give us some good XP around here. All right, we're back. Uh, I've been saving up all this hide because we have an Ascendant uh, Rex blueprint that uh, I think it's 47,000 hide that it needs. So it's pretty crazy. It's going to take me a while to uh, get that. I've been saving up a few levels here. So let's uh, let's do this. How about we do a bunch of these and a bunch of these? How does that sound? 195 speed and 2500 melee so far. Check him out. He's pretty fast. He still has pretty bad aim, though. <laughs> uh, speed gives these things a pretty good turning radius, though. It improves quite a bit. So uh, let's see if we can climb up this hill. Nope, we're not going to make it. All right, we're back, and here is the Ascendant Pteranodon saddle. We've got everything, uh, the 2400 Chitin Keratin, 4000 fiber. Whoops. Let's see here. Let's do that. Craft it. All right. Let's get back over to uh, round two. Our Rex is beat up. Not because he got beat up. It's because uh, I boosted his health a couple times. So he's... Uh, he's making a ten-point turn around here. Ugh. All right, check it out. We've uh, we've got our speed boosted up pretty high. It's up to 222, and melee is 3500. I do want to boost melee a little bit more, um, but let's get this way better saddle over here on you, my friend, Ascendant Saddle. So that has much better armor. Let's check it out. Wait, durability armor 102. Uh, oh, yeah, I guess that is. That's four times better than the primitive one. So that's pretty awesome. All right, we're back. We've got Rexy Poo over by the hut. And uh, I've been gathering a bunch of hide and fiber. Um, we just need some metal ingots now. And uh, instead of carrying all that stuff over, <laughs> um, I figured what I would do, since I can't carry all this, let's see. Um, I would make a smithy over here at the house where I already have all the metal ingots. I've got like 10,000 metal ingots uh, that I was going to use on that lightsaber. Um, so I need to make a smithy real quick. Let's see. Smithy. I thought I had... Oh, five. I need five metal ingots. There we go. So we should be able to make the smithy now. Whoops, make sure I make the right one. There we go. And let's plop that puppy down right here. And let's get all that stuff in here. So we need the keratin in here. Uh, is that all I have from here? Let's see. Let's put that blueprint in here for a second. We need, how much can I carry that? Yep, I carry that. All right, we still need some hide. And we need this fiber. Almost there. Rexy Poo is gonna have the best saddle available. All right, uh, fiber. Looks like we need, I can't tell how much we have here. Um, let's see, we need 5,000 more fiber and the 6,200 metal. 
I know I have more fiber. Where did it go? There it is. Alright, perfect. So now we just need to transfer that metal over here and we will be ready. So this is going to take a while. Alright, we've got it all. Um, 6,200 metal ingots I'm using for this. I can't believe it. Alright, but let's craft it anyway. All right, Rexy Poo, you're going to be set. Let's take that. All right, let's check out the stats real quick. Uh, 323 armor, 868 durability versus 25 armor. That is insane. That is crazy armor. I like it. Very nice. Well, I'm glad we got something made with all that stuff that we... Spent all that time collecting. Um, let's see. I need to take this blueprint back to the hut or to the community hut. And um, let's actually, let's fly. Let's fly round two, who also has an ascendant saddle. Very nice. Take him back here. All right. I think that is good. We are done with that. Sweet. All right. Well, that is going to be it for today. We got a couple new animals, a couple new awesome animals, and uh, we made the saddles for them. So I hope you guys are liking it. Um, I hope we uh, we get the Star Wars mod back on at some point. Um, that would be really nice, but uh, we'll see how it goes. All right. We'll see you later.